I am Goose. I'm Logan. We're at Saunders. So we are currently on Brim Hall, yep. uh, right near Callaway, mm -hmm. and uh, we come to a place called Saunders, uh, mm -hmm. an American cuisine. Um, this is a place we've been hearing a lot of good things about lately. Yeah, I've, I've, it's a nice, I've, said American comfort food comfort restaurant. Food re so it, I, I've heard a lot of good things about this restaurant. I've heard it advertised, um, and it's been on my list. I know it's been on my list for, for several months. Uh, been trying to find just the right time to come on down here and check it out. So. Here we are. Here we are. Time to check it out. All right. So, looking here at the menu, look at some starters, regular kind of some Brussels sprouts, buffalo cauliflower. What in the world is that? Buffalo roasted cauliflower, buffalo sauce, gargonzola, house slaw. Interesting. Uh, some pizza dip, some poutine. We never had, we never had poutine. It's actually pretty good. Mm -hmm. uh, not, it has like fries with like gravy on it. Gravy on it. Some cheese. Yeah. Some white wine, steamed mussels and clams. Yeah. We've got our water. Uh, Sandra wings. I uh, got some greens over here. Some chopped cobs. You know, some poke salad. Some bruschetta over here. Down here, the sand uh, sandwiches and the burgers. Philly cheesesteak. Buffalo chicken. Cubano. Grinder. A bacon burrito. Mm -hmm. And another one over here called a hot mess. And the girlfriend. That actually sounds pretty good. Over here, some of the main event: some ch uh, steak and chops, some New York strip, filet mignon, uh, Sandra baby back ribs. Some pasta dishes are over here. Fettuccine Alfredo, traditional bologna pasta, some lobster ravioli. Got some poultry here, some fried chicken. Got some seafood choices over here. Uh, salmon, some market fish, some tacos, uh, over here some sides, and salads, and fries, and rice pilaf, and onion rings, and some sweets, and cheesecake, and creme brulee. Yeah, this all looks really good, so we're gonna try to figure out what we're gonna eat. Oh, almost forgot. We got chocolate menus over here for the 21 and over crowd. Uh, different wines on the back. I'm not gonna go into details. And then they have their signature cocktails. The usual suspect, the besos, the mi amor. It looks really good. So this is unusual. As we're sitting here talking, we just order a food, we're sitting here talking, all of a sudden the alarm went off, so. I, I don't know what to mean. I don't know if we're supposed to be evacuated or, or, or if the, the Oh, thank God. <laughs> it wasn't that bad. <laughs> yes, it was. <laughs> it's a loud screech. It was like, for like two straight minutes. Uh, yeah. And it happened out of nowhere. I don't, I'm trying to look around me and see like what, what Usually, caused that awful noise. Usually it's something like, you know, it's, it's like someone's running out the back with their, you know, they just stole a 12 pack of beer and they're running out yeah. the back. <laughs> and I'm just saying, well, what, what the, what? <sighs> that was weird. Yeah, it was weird. So we were a little unsure about getting an appetizer because they were a little expensive. They were like, a little, yeah, a little pricey. They were all over like, I think the cheapest one they had was $14, but we asked them how big a plate of nachos was. And he said, Oh, they're they're pretty good. Big yeah. enough to share. That's, that's, that, that's, so we decided to go with it. That's pretty big. Mm -hmm. A lot bigger, so you know. And they, we got our sour cream. Sour cream. We got our our uh, salsa. We got our guacamole. Our guacamole and they didn't charge us fourteen dollars for it, like La Costa. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So this looks delicious. And he's already been digging in over there. It must be good. Time for me to dig in. I gotta admit, these nachos are really good. Mm -hmm. they, I mean, and it's just, it's, it's, how do I explain this? It's not like, you know, I've seen nachos before where it's like, 
they just take some chips and heat them up and put some toppings on top of them. But like these chips, let me just spin this around. These chips are a lot of toppings. A lot of toppings. The chips are real crispy. I mean, you can get down to like down to the bean dip here. It's really good. I mean, we just we can't seem to keep our hands off. They're not good. They're really good. And even the because I got the the pico de gallo jalapenos olives, and I, I think you were about to say the jalapenos aren't that spicy. They're not that spicy. They aren't really like mm -hmm. burning my mouth. These are actually not that spicy, but it's actually it's really good. Got a little kick to it. Yep. Couple of jalapenos. As the chip breaks. No, not the olive. <laughs> Stuff. I wanted to show this to you. Look at all the toppings on this one chip Damn. that I am about to devour. Oh my gosh. That's pretty hot. I'm not throwing that. Mm-hmm. Little pico de gallo. Mm-hmm. Oh, the that uh, pepper is just nice. It's not, not that hot. Not that hot. Get another one with just a lot of bees. Mm -hmm. Look at all that, put all that beer cheese on there. What the? Yeah, what happened was there was a, a chip that was completely uh, like drowning in the cheese, and so I had to I, did, I had to save it with another chip. As you can see there. The oh, yeah, chip on the bottom. Cheese. What a beautiful thing. Mm -hmm. yeah. As the beer cheese drips from his mouth. <laughs> Alright, so you just got your burger. Yeah, Wait, I got the, the girlfriend burger. Right the here. girlfriend burger. Now, what's in the girlfriend burger? Yeah. Uh, Wagyu beef patty, gorgonzola cheese, onions, it's like garlic aioli. And I can't remember everything on there, but once I saw that, I was like, that's what I wanted. It looks good. Oh, yeah. It's big. We got both of our fries. Mm -hmm. Little bowl of fries. The ketchup. Mm -hmm. I got the Baker burrito. It had um, shades of what was it? Shards? Not shades. Shards. I don't even know shards. Beef? It's got beef in it. Um, yeah, that's all I can remember. <laughs> I don't know why. It, it just sounded really good because. You know, having a, getting a, kind of when you're getting a burrito, and they served on these big old, well, we thought were plates, but these are look like big old planks of wood. Uh, they were telling us about their nachos that they, they make everything in house, mm -hmm. all the cheese and toppings and everything they make in house, and it is just you can taste it. it's really good. They can take they take a lot of good care with us because Logan continues to dig into the nachos. Because the nachos, I think, all by themselves, the nachos. We could have done a video just of the nachos. Mm -hmm. You know, but we got our we got our burger, we got our burrito. I know there's like beef in my burrito. That's about it. But it looks like I got time to dig in. Time to dig in. You already take a bite of your my good friend burger from burger, and give you a shot of the inside of that. The wagyu beef patty, as well as the That's cheese, a huge -ass patty. lettuce, or whatever greens I have. It's not the lettuce, but it's good. It's good. Oh yeah. It looks like it's good. Mm -hmm. And these fries are also really good. You can tell, yeah. they're, you can tell they're like made in house because I guess, I don't know, they don't look like regular fries. Yeah, they look like they were cut here. Exactly. <laughs> and they are delicious. Yeah. I'm taking a few bites of my, my burrito. You can see the meat. I got cheese. I mean, the cheese in here is just mm. really good. It's got some potato. I think it's got like french fries in here. It's potatoes. What, it's what kind of meat was it? I want to say beef. It's just some. It, it's like like cut beef, like almost mm. like flank steak, maybe. It's really good. I give you a chance. I give you a bite of it a little bit. I put some of this salsa on here, uh -huh. and it's a little. It's got a good kick to it. It's spicy. It kind of like kind of knocked me for a little bit. Like the first bite I took, I was like, mm. <laughs> but this is really good. It's nice and cheesy, meaty. Got some potatoes in here. Potatoes in here. You really see it. It's really good. It does look good. It does look good. 
to you about halfway through your, your, your girlfriend burger, mm -hmm. and I was asking you what you thought of the gorgonzola, and you were like... It's interesting. I don't know if it's related to blue cheese, but I took it. I had taken a bite of it, and I got a big, like, taste of blue cheese. So I don't know if gorgonzola is related to blue cheese. Or... I have to look it up. Oh, that's one of the tastes I got. And I was like, I'm not familiar with gorgonzola, so... Yeah. Yeah, that was, but that was just weird because that's not what I was expecting. Well, something we, gotta, we should go ask Miss Cindy when we're done. Yeah. And you took a, you took a little bit of taste of that uh, that salsa I have had. You were that like, was really <laughs> much spicier than the one they gave us for the nachos. Oh my gosh! No kidding. Uh, like I said, you can clear up my sinuses. Yeah. I want to give you a good, better shot of my burrito, my bagel burrito. And now you can see the fries. You see the fries in here. Then they got the peppers and the cheese uh, in here with the beef. What call shredded beef? That is what it's shredded beef. Mm -hmm. um, but it's really delicious. It's, the, it's like a kind of a meat and potatoes kind of thing. They wrap in a in a tortilla, so it's really good. And about halfway through this, I'm gonna get done with this and be right back. I want to give you one last look at this bako burrito. And again, it is just packed in there with meat mm -hmm. and fries and peppers and cheese. And yeah, it was funny. You even mm. thought you had found uh, this little strip of bacon in there, but it turned out it was just another fry. Yeah, just that had looked yeah. like bacon. Yeah, it, it gives the illusion of uh, whether they have it in there. It looks like bacon, but it's really good. Like I said, the, the taste contrast in this is really good. You're at the tail end of your burger. Yes. You want that shot of it? One that shot of it. Look at all that meat. It is delicious. The Wagyu. Yeah. <laughs> Again, I'm full. I am too. I, I know I say it a lot, but I'm full. I mean, that food was delicious. Dude, From the nachos phenomenal. to the, the girlfriend burger to your bako burrito. Yeah, I mean, I, I was telling Logan, I said, we could probably have done a video on just the nachos yeah because they were so good i mean we, we were like we when we first like because we don't normally order uh appetizers mm -hmm. um because we like to save our our room for the food but it was like oh let's get some some nachos and we're like, well how big are they gonna be and he was like oh they're gave us they a, were a lot they were a lot it was it was huge um like i said probably those nachos would have just been a meal yeah, for, just, by for, just by themselves, and it was delicious. If you got a chance to come to Sonder, they're again, they're right over here on Brimhall, right over here near a Callaway Drive, and um, the food's really good. The American Beach Show, they do have some crab cocktails, mm -hmm. uh, but oh my gosh, that was amazing! That was amazing. So, Logan, if they want to check us out anywhere else, where they go, if you want to find all the links to our social medias, you can find them at withcoach.com. At Travel by Nature, they can find links to our podcasts, mm -hmm. our Twitter pages, our Instagram, our TikTok, and we also have an Ask Me Anything tab and a TikTok if you're so generous. Yeah! And look at if they want to help out the channel, what do they do? You can hit the like button, subscribe, hit the notification bell, and share it to your friends. Yeah, share it up to your friends, leave us a comment, makes us smile. Oh, what else can they do? If you really like our content, please consider becoming a member of this yep. channel. To do that, you just go to the home page of our channel. There will be a little join button next to subscribe. In there, we have three tiers, one $4.99, one $7.99, one $9.99. Right. So if you really enjoy our content, please consider uh, subscribing. And because all the money uh, you give us goes right back. Goes into right back videos. into making the videos, make, go right back into the channel. And we're just now starting to add one extra video a week just for yep. our members just exclusively for our members and we might even go back and find some of our older videos that yep. will just have be just exclusively for mm -hmm. our members i haven't decided yet i'm kind of thinking about it we're still thinking but with that being said from here at sonder on brim hall and callaway i'm kush i'm logan this is travel by nature thank you for watching <laughs>